Hi tubers. Just an update on my Claude Butler. I have just purchased a brand new chain for it. It's a Shimano IG51 6, 7 and 8 speed compatible. Which is exactly what I need <coughs> as I'm making it an 8 speed bug. So, later tonight, hopefully, I will be purchasing a freewheel. I'm not sure if I'll get the 8 speed gear shifters this time round. I may wait till next time round. Depends <coughs> how far I can stretch my funds, but at least I'll have the chain and the free wheel. <coughs> also, while I was clearing up earlier on that desk, I found this cycle computer I actually bought from a local charity shop. Still brand new, packed in its box. Obviously, I've ripped the box open and got rid of it because I was going to fit this to the bike that got stolen. Obviously, the bike got stolen, so I never got around to it. I haven't decided whether to fit it to the Claude Butler over there or if I should fit it to another Claude Butler I've got downstairs. I've got a hybrid Claude Butler downstairs, which I'll probably do a video on sometime in the future. Anyway. I think that's about it. I can't think of anything else. The only downside of this is the battery was dead, so it's not a very modern cycle computer. So I expect it's been sitting around in its box for quite a number of years, which is why the battery was dead. I'll get a new battery for it. I may may or may not fit it to the Claude Butler I've got up here. I haven't decided yet. I do have a couple of more a couple more um, cycle computers kicking around. I know at least one of them does need a new battery as well. <coughs> Ooh, excuse me. Um, I'm not sure how many I've got the instructions for though. I find in, you need the instructions because you need to program your wheel size in. And most sort of computers are different, so it's always handy to keep the manual. It's all complete. Bracket, cable, magnet, straps, everything there. That will be the last thi one of the last things that I'll fit to the bike. Worry about get it getting it into. Try that again. Getting it into working order. Once that's all sorted, all the gears and brakes and is sorted and it's got the pedals and the seat on it. I had a look for a pair of pedals yesterday but I've got nothing I'd want to stick on it anyway so I'll buy a new pair. Yeah, I think that's about it. I'm going to end the video here. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you later.